is DV5 faster than DV4? So as you know, DV5 Alpha has just been released. So I'm very curious to find out if DV5 is actually faster than DV4 because DV4 has a bunch of short codes. So we are told that DV5 is really fast. Now in using both of these, clearly we can see that DV5 is actually faster, but how does that translate? when we do a speed test. So my test here is very simple. I have a DV5 website and a DV4 website, and we're going to use the Google tool to test the speed of these two websites. So what we're gonna do is we're going to install a basic starter site on both websites, a similar one, and then test to see how this works. All right, so here I have a DV4. So you can tell by taking a look here at the top left where it says DV4 speed, and then here I have a DV5 speed. I've already installed DV4 and DV5. So what I need to do now is to install the starter sites. So over here I'm on DV5. So I'm gonna go in and click on create a new site and we are going to use a pre-made starter site. All right, so now I'm just gonna go with this basic one here. I'm gonna say start with low firm. I'm not gonna add anything here. In fact, I'm gonna leave WooCommerce in there just to see if this is going to be fast. So let's go ahead now and generate and publish the website. So while this is happening, I'm gonna head over here to a DV4. We're also gonna do the same thing. We're gonna generate a new site and I'm gonna say use pre-made starter site. All right, so now with that selected, I'm also going to choose this one right here. And just like how I did before, I'm gonna leave WooCommerce on there. So I'm gonna say generate and publish my site. Now I know that these two websites, uh, one of them, although the sites are similar, they're going to be uh, different because of the page builder that's running um, under them. All right, so let's see if DV5 is complete and we can see here it's still activating WooCommerce and also here things are happening. Now this test is very important because as we build our websites, speed is going to be one of those factors that are going to help us uh, rank in Google because ranking of course is important. The last thing we wanna do is to get penalized because our website is slow. Secondly, if DV5 is not really faster than DV4, then what's the point of all this? Why not just add new features like Flexbox, blah, 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 and so on. So let's wait and see. I don't wanna to get too uh, ahead of myself here. So, so far I can see here this site is ready. Now this is the DV4. Okay, so this one is ready. Let's go ahead and take a look at it by clicking on visit site. So I'm gonna open this in a new tab. Now we're not gonna do anything here. I haven't tested this before, by the way. So it's going to be very curious to see what happens. All right, so over here, it looks like the site is ready as well. I'm gonna view the site and it opens in a new tab. All right, so as we can see here, the sites look very similar. Now, I'm not sure why this image here in the background is not showing. Uh, let me refresh this again. Oh, there we go. So now the image is showing. The only thing that's not showing here is the logo. Oh, they're both not showing. The both logos are not showing. So, but pretty much everything else is the same. All right. The moment of truth. I'm just double checking here to make sure everything is all right. So the moment of truth, we're going to start with DV4. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy this link right here. And I already have page speed insights open. I'm gonna enter my URL like that and then click on analyze. Now, once this, while this is happening, I'm also going to come over here to DV5, copy the link, and then I'm gonna go in a separate tab here and paste to see how things are going to work out here. All right, so this is still happening. And of course, this one here is also happening. Okay, um, <laughs> fingers crossed, I'm still worried uh, that these two might be the same, but I'll be super excited if DB5 actually wins this because, man, we've been waiting for this speed for a very long time. All right, so it looks like we have our results. So on the mobile, overall, the performance here is 66. Okay, now we can go into a lot more detail here if we need to, but I wanna mainly focus on this here, okay? If we go on the desktop, surprisingly, it's, it's quite high. It's 92. 
that's interesting. There's no caching plugin. There's no uh, image optimization. So this is very interesting, actually. Okay, so now let's go to DB5. <laughs> okay, slightly better. This is 80. And on the desktop, it's 95. Whew. This is very interesting. Okay, so here we are 92 on DB4. And here we are 95. And this is on the desktop. So let's take a look here and see what is happening. So if we scroll all the way down here, let's go to the tree. In fact, this is too much information here, but this pretty much gives us an idea of what is happening on the site. Okay. Um, what I'm going to do here is to take a look at the things that are not uh, optimized properly here. So I can see reduce unused CSS, potential saving of seven um, kilobytes, potential saving of, okay. So it looks like there's a few things here that needs to be updated. This is DB5, by the way. Now on the mobile, 80. Now I'm not sure why this is at 80. Anyway, it has a few more issues here, which is quite cool. And then the accessibility here is 78. Best practices, 96. So SEO 92. Okay. So, so far, I'm going to go ahead and say, well, this is the alpha. I don't think it's fully optimized yet, but it's very interesting to see that this is 80% or uh, yeah, 80 versus on the mobile here, 66. This is a huge difference. So I'm really happy that at least DV5 alpha is performing better than DV4 at the moment. Now, are there other ways of um, testing this? Perhaps they are, but uh, this is just a basic test just to see how things are working. Now, what I may want to do is to see what happens if I start adding optimization plugins and see if we can bump that score up. This will be coming up in the next video. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think in the comments box below. I know uh, there may be other ways of testing this, but uh, yeah, I just thought I'd just do a quick one, uh, which doesn't take a lot of time. If you haven't um, subscribed onto DV University yet, please go ahead and do that. This is an online community for DV users. It's absolutely free. The link to that is in the video description below. And if you haven't purchased DV, go ahead and do that. It also comes in with some bonuses. Link to that is also in the video description below. Until next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.